Hey, what's up, YouTube land? It's your boy, Eddie Hill, the White Oak, Pennsylvania toy collector, and it's time for another Eddie Hill review. It's review time, people! And today we'll be reviewing the Marvel McFarlane Black Adam with Frost King Build-A-Figure. And yes, I got me a Build-A-Figure. I have a Transformers Build-A-Figure of Mech Adams from Cyberverse, but I didn't get all the pieces. If I had all the pieces, I'd be able to transform him on camera. But other than that, I can't review him until I have his pit pieces. If I find all his pieces at the Goody Will, I would sure make a day of an early day at the Goody Will when I go this month. Maybe I'll find the rest of those Build-A-Figure pieces and be able to put together the Mech Adams figure. But for now, I'm happy I got this figure. There are three other figures to collect in this wave. I will show you off each figure to collect. This is an awesome figure. Um, I'm not going to dig out any comparisons. I just want to get this video done. We're going to talk about Black Adam. As you know, Black Adam from the DC Comics is the mortal enemy, enemy of Shazam, a.k.a. Captain Marvel. But other than that, that's what I know about his character. And yeah, he is a bad guy. But in the... Black Adam movie was he was portrayed by The Rock, which was kind of cool. I did take take his collector card out, so here is his DC McFarlane collector card, and look at that. That's an awesome figure art of Black Adam, and he is the Justice League Endless Winter. And man, does he look cool? You get his name, his bio, if you want to read it. That's nice to give you a bio card. But now that we're done looking at the card, we're going to look at the figure. DC Multiverse, Black Adam, Collect to Build Frost King, and some more DC add-ons for the box. And now we're going to turn the box around. And here is the figure, Frost Giant. And yeah, you, you have to collect all four of these to build it. So I don't have... Wonder Woman, Batman, or Green Lantern. But once I get all three of them, including John Stewart, Green Lantern, we will definitely put this thing together. If I find these guys at the toy show here in Pittsburgh and I get them for a good price, like 10 bucks each, I might complete Frost Giant and review the whole set. But now that we're done talking about the box, let's open this puppy up and look at Black Adam. First, he comes with, I have to remove the camera back, he comes with Frost Giant's legs, which are part of the Build-A-Figure. And these legs are articulated, somewhat, but he's really tight on some of them. I might have to loosen them up a little bit just to make them poseable. But yeah, definitely look forward to building this guy. You know me, Build-A-Figures look awesome. Sure, they're a bit tight, but they'll look cool on the shelf. But for now, he's just probably going to sit in the parts bin, for all I know. But now we're going to stand up Black Adam and look at Black Adam in all his glory before we stand him up and show him off. But here we got Black Adam. He's really well sculpted, painted, and done really well. His head's a little bit tight. But yeah, I'm afraid to break his head because it's super tight. His arms can move, so he can get some punch action, huh? And it's cool. His legs move somewhat. Oh, yeah, he's got some slight ab crunch. But it's really tight, and I don't want to break Black Adam. But he is pretty cool. His feet do move. Doesn't have a lot of ankle tilt, but he's got some. But look at that. He's really well done. But now to get him with his electricity so he can go fight some heroes. And yes, you can get him to wield his electricity. And he could be like, ha ha ha, I have you at your match, Captain Marvel. I will zap you with my electricity for the Legion of Doom, which I am joining. 
I may be all-powerful, but I still can't beat that Billy Batson on my own. Maybe it's time I consider an alliance with that so-called villains club, the Legion of Doom, to accomplish my objective. Yes. He, he's gonna look cool with the lightning pieces on. The trick is trying to get him on his wrist without breaking him, but look at that. Eat electricity, Billy Batson. Rah! Zappity zap. And yeah, he could be like Emperor Palpatine going zappity zap. He doesn't stand up very well. I'm gonna show you. If I can get him to stand without falling, he might fall if I'm not careful. Well, maybe not. Look at that. He's actually standing. Oh, man, that is just so cool. Is a Marvel. Not a Marvel, but a DC McFarlane. Black Adam. Worth adding to a DC collection. I'd say yes. Pick him up. He looks awesome. And I'm so glad to be adding him to my collection. And if you enjoyed this video as much as I enjoyed making it, please make sure to like, please make sure to comment, and don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this. And this has been DC McFarlane Multiverse Black Adam. And this is Eddie Hill. Moving on. And rock on and rock out YouTube land.